Well, I'll be giving these to the people at church tonight. Yeah, I got way more eggs than I could ever eat. I'm one person, I can't eat all these eggs. And these things are still laying. But, uh, reason for this video is because I went and fed and I didn't see any of the baby chicks. Like, I couldn't find them. Now, I had six. I found two that were that were dead in the pen. I, I still don't know how they passed away. But I'm thinking one of them big roosters or something maybe stepped on them. I, my roosters aren't violent towards anything, but I'm thinking that's what made it happen. But I come in here today, I've done been around all this property looking for these little ducklings. Looking, looking, looking everywhere. And that mama hen there, she just painted my butt. But then I happened to notice some little movement down outside. These little things, boy, had me looking all around here going, where are my ducklings? I don't even know where they get by her. They should stay over there by that big black chicken. Mean old mama duck. But it's still cold. It just got finished raining. And mama hen, she's a good hen. I... You know, I know she had a bunch of chicks, and she's only got three left, but it's not her fault. Will you shut up? Quack, 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 quack. That's that big white one over there. That thing loves to talk. But, yeah, everything's uh, pretty, pretty much the same. Just uh, a whole lot of cleanup. And, uh... The mulberry, I, can't. I thought, I thought it would come back, but no, I think, I think it's done for a year. Hopefully, it comes back next year. If not, I'll go get another cutting and replant it in the ground. As you can see, that was from a cutting, that one and that one. There's a old mulberry tree over there, back where I used to live. The house was built in, I think, 1867. It's an old, old house. And uh, they tore it down. It's, uh, I don't know why they did that. But the historical division wouldn't wouldn't allow, you know, for them. It, down here in the south, south Louisiana, when the historical division gets involved, they will actually, you know, help maintain the house. But they said the house was too far gone. And uh, the owner of the house... He passed away and his children sold the property and the house and uh, they tore it down. The house, the barn, everything. And right now they got bulldozers over there. I don't know what they're going to do with bulldozers, but okay. But yeah, it was uh, that's where I got them cunnies from for that tree. So if it does pass away or if it don't come back next year, I'll just go get more cutting. Because it's right there on a coulee well a coulee we call it a coulee some people call it a creek some people call it a ditch a big ditch I and mean, that's pretty much what it is just big ditch but yeah so uh, and then that one there i forgot to tell y'all that that this one here come from my papa's house this was a cutting that i got i think two years ago look how thick that is yeah, this is uh, two years old, so it's like I said in my other videos, it's been through a frost, but never a hard freezing. Not like it went through last night. So, might come out here and grab some of the okra out here. Yeah, uh, no, they're no good. No, they're all mushy. So that man tells me they froze solid. Look at this, see if y'all can see that. Look, <laughs> it froze solid. <laughs> That's so weird for South Louisiana. <laughs> Especially this early. I mean, usually we, we get some freezes from time to time, but they don't last this long. I mean, this lasts like 10 hours. Yeah, they're no good. So I'll just let them do what they do. Come springtime, I'll come in here. And just till it all up. See what happens. And if y'all wonder why I got orange peels and everything, because like orange peels and uh stuff like that and 
coffee grinds and eggshells. I just come out here and just throw it out here. And then next year I'll till it all up, till it all into the ground, and it'll be good. But okay, you have a good night and God bless.